Hi and welcome to another Instrument Choice support video. In this video we'll run through the settings, setup, navigation and how to monitor lightning strike distance on the Strike Alert HD3000 personal lightning detector. To start, install the included AA batteries. To do so, extend and rotate the metal tab and open the battery cover by gripping the sides of the cover and pulling it away. Insert the included batteries and replace the cover. Press and hold the power button for a few seconds to switch the device on. Straight away, the strike alert begins to detect strikes. Strikes are indicated in two ways. This is by the LEDs above the screen and by the cloud graphic on the LCD. The five LEDs are different colours for quick and easy interpretation. The green LED will remain on while the unit is on. If this LED is flashing, there may be some interference, for example, motors or other high-powered electronic equipment. The remaining four LEDs indicate strike distances. The blue is 40 to 60 kilometers away, yellow is 20 to 40 kilometers away, orange is 10 to 20 kilometers away, and red is 0 to 10 kilometers away. When a strike is detected, the LED corresponding to the distance of the strike will remain lit for two minutes. If there is another strike during this time that is further away, the LED for the distance will light for two seconds before disappearing. If the new strike is closer, the new LED will light up for two minutes and replace the previous LED. At the same time, detected strikes are indicated by the same color-coded bolts extending from the cloud. However, unlike the LEDs, all bolts will remain displayed for the full two minutes. Pressing the left facing arrow takes you to the settings menu. Here you can turn on or off the following functions. Two hour auto off. The unit automatically switches off after two hours to conserve battery life. To turn this function off and keep the unit on until manually switched off, press the select key. Next is the sound alarm. Press select to turn on or off the audible strike alert. When switched on, one beep will sound for the furthest distance, up to four beeps for the nearest distance. Next is a vibration alarm. Press select to turn on or off the vibration strike alert alarm. When switched on, the vibrate duration will increase as the strike distance decreases. The last selection is distance view between miles or kilometers. Press select to choose your desired unit. When all parameters are selected, pressing the right facing arrow takes you back to the cloud display, or pressing the left facing arrow takes you to the storm trend and intensity histogram. This displays a one hour history in five minute intervals of all strikes. The same colors as the LED are used to indicate the distance. The histogram is a great tool to use to obtain a sense of intensity and direction of the storm. The example on the screen shows a storm getting closer and gaining intensity. The only thing left to do is head outside and take some readings during a storm. There's no specific or fiddlesome way to take measurements thanks to the 360 degree tracking. You just need to have it switched on and in the area you wish to measure. We can see our 0 to 10 km strike indicator has illuminated, which will remain on for the full 2 minutes. The 20 to 40 km indicator lights up for 2 seconds as another strike is detected. As we continue watching, there are further detections for 40 to 60 and 10 to 20, with all bolts now displaying on the cloud graphic. And that's how straightforward it is to monitor lightning strike distance using the Strike Alert HD3000 personal lightning detector. For more information on this meter, speak with an instrument choice scientist. Call 1300 737 871 or email customer service at instrumentchoice.com.au. We hope that you found this video helpful. Thanks for watching.